Previously on Super Minecraft. As time goes on, Asgard comes closer and closer to its epic completion. The pillars were the first thing I had shown off. Then, after wandering the village some nights ago, I had discovered something that stood out on the tree in the middle of town. What other duties will need our attention? Find out today on this episode of Super Minecraft. Hey guys, Afmao here, and can you feel the love tonight? Welcome to Super Minecraft. <laughs> Today in America, it is Valentine's Day, and of course, it is a day of love and all that kind of crazy stuff. Not to just celebrate with who you love, but what doing what you love. And that's the way that I look at Valentine's Day, just doing what you love. And I love playing Super Minecraft with you guys. So not only that, but I have a few things that I've given other players here in Super Minecraft for the day of love. And um, I'm gonna show you guys that, but as well, we're gonna be doing some other things uh, that are kind of in theme with the day. But first, what I wanted to do was, um, I think it's turning day soon, which is perfectly fine. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys uh, some work that's been done on Asgard while it's turning day before I go um, because a few rooms have been added and a few new things have been done and I know this like every single time we do an episode there's always some progress on Asgard uh, but right now I'm kind of getting ready for a group session that's coming up so I'm really excited about that so like the next episode will probably be uh, solo and then the next one will be a group session but I'm really excited I'm just getting ready for the group sessions and stuff like that um, Oh, I need that because I need to finish the bridge to Asgard, which I've done some more work on. And oh my gosh, it's just work, work, work constantly. But that's what it's about. I love seeing the buildings come together and still hyped for this stuff. All right. So as you can see, some of the pillars have been connected now. So that is new. Some pillars are being added. And of course, they will be connected over time. And this going to the corners of Asgard, like a little... Like the way Asgard actually looks, if you look up a picture of the um, actual Asgard from the movies. Um... But if we come over here, we'll see that more things have been added to the bridge, more little infused star stones, as well as, I'm not sure, I'm still working on what I want to do, because I know in the last episode I showed you guys how to uh, use the invisible stepping blocks to get up here, but I think I might actually use the wed slopes, and I'm not sure about that yet, but I'm still thinking about it. And look, love! Love is all over Asgard, because it's the day of love, and love is... Anyway, <laughs> that's exactly how I celebrate Valentine's Day. As you can see, we've got all all this gold coming in here like I'm one of those like I'm I'm like Tupac or not not Tupac um what is it little John's grill like up in here it's just really cool um blocks of gold have been added and they're still being added up and up and up and up as we keep going I'm not sure if I'm gonna make the entire stairs out of gold but I'm still working on that over here um, these wedges have been added, which is why there's a wedge over there, because these wedges have been added to make this area look a little bit more smoother instead of, like, little, like, all choppy like that. Um, still when wanting to put the design in on this, but I'm not entirely sure if I want to make it out of, uh, marble or something else, so that's something I'm waiting on. Um, let's see, oh, the new rooms in Asgard. Now, if we come over here, I'm actually going to need some light for this stuff. I should have put this in beforehand, but I'm gonna go ahead and quickly grab this, uh, tools torches I'm just gonna put a few down so we can see a little bit better um if I come over here let me put this right here you'll see that there have been added new little stairs here and these stairs lead to new rooms in Asgard now this part of Asgard has been done um there's a room here as you can see, this needs to be lit up. All this stuff just needs to be lit up. Just light this stuff up. There's a new room here. We got one room. Then we have this room on top of the base of operations, which is another giant room, which is, I, there's got to be cool stuff going in here. And like I said, I kind of want every room dedicated to a mod. So this is another room. Um, I'm giving you like, you know, S, uh, S, uh, super, <laughs> S, super Minecraft, uh, SM, um, cribs here giving you like a little tour here's another big room over the room that's um on the right backhand corner of asgard so this is another room being added uh still well, still like a work in progress oh my gosh there's still so many things that need to be done here uh but yeah so there's some little stairs coming up here there will be stairs added so that way the peasants who have to you know slowly walk up here will be able to walk i need to add some stairs here because i just keep jumping 
Um, so yeah, there's this new section of Asgard that's added. Of course, these rooms will be filled with really cool stuff. Uh, one going to T Tinker's Construct. And then over here, of course, we have... Eh, eh. We have this big room that's been added. Just There's four new rooms in Asgard, which I'm super excited about. So as we can see, I'm just putting this down for you guys so you can see a little bit better. As you can see, these rooms are just huge and need to be filled and thank god thank goodness for deco craft because i'm gonna have so much fun using the little decorations for it um i'm actually looking to see if maybe i could suggest like another 1.7.10 mod that does a lot of decorating stuff just because i like to see like all that kind of cool little decor stuff going in but yeah this part this side of asgard has been uh done as far as rooms well not completely done but you know good as far as rooms i don't like those Clone copies! Uh, <laughs> and now this side of Asgard's gonna need to be worked on as far as uh, getting some rooms in, getting some of the structures set down, you know, something set in place. And of course lighting needs to go in. These torches, don't worry guys, these torches are just here uh, just because I wanted to show off Asgard in a, in a new light, you know, just see it in a new way. But anyway, let's go over um, what I've given others and then we're going to go ahead and do one more thing that has to relate to the heart-shaped day. Oh, yes, that's right, that's right, the police station. The police station is now, it's open, but I don't think it's functional yet. But it is done, because if you remember, I worked on the quest over here, and uh, I'm super excited about this, because it just looks so cool. And like I said, it's I don't think it's completely functional yet, but I can go in, as you can see, it just looks really cool. And look, there's these really cool things, and I don't, that just looks really cool. There's like little wanted posters, and it's just, I'm excited about this, and I don't know where they got these. Is that a little? The, oh, they, oh, they got to take showers. The police station people. That's so cute. Um, but yeah, so they, we got all this cool. We got the. They got beds. They got um. They got a bunch of cool stuff in here. Do you, oh, I'm not gonna go in there, lady. Uh, but yeah, they've got all this really cool stuff in here. They've got all this really cool stuff in here, and I'm just really excited to come back here and with a group and check that out but yeah so the police station is uh done and then what i've done for um everyone here at the hall well, at the hall at their little homes i've done something to everyone's house um for valentine's day um i've decided to give out little gifts like small little gifts i don't know if like they're liked but i put hearts on cats's house as you can see um cats has all his windows full of hearts so he knows he's loved um and you can see I there's something here. Oh yeah, I gave him this too. You can hear that. I gave him a little a little robin. Gave him a little tiny robin as you can see. And it's actually named um let's see. It's called Robin the Bird Wonder because he's he's Batman Beyond, so I gave him a little a little robin. And uh, I know robins are supposed to be red, but I only could find the blue one. So don't worry. It's 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 okay. The robin dyed his hair. You know how like how I like the ladies and the guys like to dye their hair. Um, I also did this for Kayla. Um, what, what's that? What's that noise? There's always weird noises around here. That is just like the creepiest thing. But I got this for Kayla. I made her a little heart room. I made her a little nice pink door, and it, her sign said "Go away." And then I put "No, I love you" because, you know, the day of liking people and no. Oh, and I put this little bunny in here and it says, please don't murder. So she's got a nice little bunny. I mean, I was going to give her a stuffed one, but I decided to give her a real one. Um, I should have really given her the stuffed one because I'm kind of afraid she's going to bludgeon someone with the with the bunny. Um, so yeah, that's a thing. Um, for Caster, as you can see, um, I gave him more hearts here. I also gave him a lot of deco craft stuff because his place needs to be decorated and... Like, I did a really good designing job, I think. Uh, I put an etch a sketch right there just in case he wanted to sketch an etch. And then I gave him, I gave him his bed back and I made it into a rainbow bed uh, with uh, the carpenter's blocks and of course put some hearts around there. So that's something for him. Um, let's see, what else did I do? Oh, for Sly, that's right, I gotta go over to Sly. Um, for Sly, let's see, I'm gonna come up here. Go this way, yeah, go super fast. I love this bat glider thing. It's so cool. If we come over to Sly's Teen Titan Tower, I've come over here because he gave me the, I was going to give him something a little bit more extravagant, but I didn't want to like interfere with any process work he's had done. Uh, like as far as uh, getting things for his other suits and I don't like those mushrooms. They're going to make me dizzy right now. Ah, get away. Ah. Did they make me dizzy? Oh no, they didn't. Cool. So I put a bunch of hearts here and then I also gave him this deer and the deer says, Dear Sly, Happy Valentine's. And I've 
put it around with a bunch of hearts. And I don't think this, this deer has itty bitty eyes. Eesh. So yeah, I've given everyone something here. Um, Alex, I couldn't find his base, but I'll like throw hearts at him or something when I see him next time. Ah, crap, it got me when I left. <sighs> Ugh, this is just the worst. All right, so that's what I did for them. So hopefully if they find it in their individual episodes, the group session, I'm excited for that. So we're going to be able to see if they like their gifts or if not. And hopefully none of the bunnies become murdered because that would be a terrible thing. <laughs> um, so that's what I've given them. Um, let's see. I didn't give Caster like a little bunny or anything because I was afraid that, you know, the ants. He loves the ants, so I was assuming that those were good enough. Um, but the next thing that I want to do is I actually want to sense... <sighs> As you all know, I have more hearts, and I need to continue to fill these yellow heart containers, and I can have a maximum of ten. So what I have right now is I have the miniature yellow hearts right here. I only have three of them, but so what, that's fine. And then I'm going to put these right there. And we're going to fill up the rest of the heart containers that I have for um, the, yellow, the yellow little hearts right here. Like I said, most of these, like, I'm just getting ready for group sessions, getting ready to do all that cool stuff with everybody. So, most of this is just me getting ready to not die, hopefully. Because I know Sly has the, the gem of, like, super strength and uh, can pummel me with one hit. Or two hits, actually. Um, since he was able to take out super... Well, actually, three hits. Because if I count the Phoenix Charm that I have on, it might take a little while for him to take me out. But I really gotta prepare myself for trouble and make sure it's doubled anyway <laughs> i need to stop with the terrible puns before i give somebody a heart attack because we're working with hearts today and it's valentine okay um so let's see for the yellow hearts all we need for the yellow heart containers all we need are golden apples all right so i can, I can do this um let's see we need a jeweled apple which is not a big deal to get so you have diamonds right here we need more apples um if I have apples, do I have apples? I better have apples. If I don't have apples, I'm gonna be kind of embarrassed. That's just a little something that I should uh, already have on me. Um, I'm also gonna get these gold nuggets out because I know I'm gonna need that. Well, I'm actually get some of these because I know I'm gonna need a bunch of gold nuggets. Nuggets actually. Let's go see if they're the apples are inside of um, Chef Ramsay's place, or if maybe I have them inside of my backpack. Maybe I do. No, I do not. Um, let's see. I think they might be in, in Chef Ramsay's, uh, Chef Ramsay the, where did he go anyway? Oh, there he is. He's in the corner. I don't know why. He just, he just likes to disappear. And maybe it's the fact that I should, uh, up the, um, the way the, the kitchen looks eventually because he just keeps blending into the surroundings and I don't like that. All right. So I'm going to have to go get some apples. So let's go ahead and do that. I'm actually super happy we have these little apple trees here because I was so worried that I was going to have to go farm apples and then I just walked outside and I was like, oh, we have apple trees, yay! So now I have a ton of apples, look at that! Just harvest all the little apples out here. This is why this is so cool to have. Um, there we go. Getting some more apples. All right, so 33 apples, I think we should be perfectly fine. I like the fact that there's like growing fruit on the, on the trees so that way if you want to harvest them, it's just so so readily available to you. That's just the best, going out and growing your own stuff. I mean, I didn't grow that tree, but whoever did, or if, the, if it just naturally generated, then I love you, nature. Nature is the best. Okay, so let's see. We have our apples. We're going to need the jeweled apples. So let's, I need three jeweled apples. So let's see. One, this is right here. Um, I could easily just do this inside of my uh, backpack, which I should really make use of, but... <laughs> Why? <laughs> I'm just joking. Uh, let's see. Uh, no, that's not how you get the golden apple. Give me a second. I have golden apples here. Can I use those? Because this one looks shiny. Uh, oh, the blocks of gold. Okay. All right. Yeah. Well, that, that's fine. I, I could do that too. So let's just use a backpack because for convenience sake, it's just so much better to use a backpack. There we go. Eh. And then, eh. One, two, three. There we go. Got three of those. Um, we also need, for this, we also need... I got the bones, and then we need an empty canister. So, aluminum, which is in, I believe, Galactic Craft stuff. There we go. Yeah, we got aluminum here. And I need three of these. One, two, three. Bam. All right. So, what I need to do for this is have those little red containers. So, it's just a jeweled apple. Apple. 
these bones, this, and a canister. So I get one, two, three little hearts here. And now I need uh, the golden apple, the heart containers, and the miniature yellow hearts. And now get the yellow heart containers. And it's just so cute. Look at that. And I can put this here and up my health. See? Three more bars will be filled. And then I gotta go into the twilight and just get some more of those yellow hearts and I'll be able to finish that up. But for now, I'm happy with what I have. Um, probably be going into the twilight in the next episode or so just to um, take on one of the bosses that I didn't finish um, there. Which is gonna be super cool because I'm really excited about that boss. Um, but we'll talk about that in the next episode, guys. So, for those of you watching, I hope you enjoyed this episode. And I hope you spend today doing what you love. Um, spending it with who you love, mom, dad you know, whoever. Even if you don't celebrate Valentine's Day or just not a thing that you do, it's just a nice day to remember that love is in the air. Quite literally, as I'm going to be throwing these hearts. <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you so much for tuning into this episode of Super Minecraft. I look forward to seeing you all in the next one. And until then, take care. Bye-bye.